Hey guys, I'm Lena. I'm Patrick. And originally this is not the way we wanted to make this video, but unfortunately some things happened. Yeah, and if you guys watching news, you know what happened. I mean, many of you guys have reached us out. I'm really grateful for that. But for those who haven't watched the news, later on we'll tell you the whole story about this trip. So I guess we better start from the very beginning. If you watched one of our previous videos where we visited the tribe, I was telling the story about me leaving Taiwan and before I go, I wanted to visit some places on my bucket list and Yishan was one of them. It's the mountain I wanted to hike for a pretty, pretty long time. Since it was really hard to get the application passed if you wanted to do the two days hike, we just decided to do it in one day. Wait, dude, yeah, like, yeah. are you cold or what? Like, how is like I'm wearing a big jacket and you're just wearing nothing? Yo, I got, I'm just sitting there and everyone's like, what's wrong with you? And I'm like, we have all the food set up for you guys already. Really? All you do is sit in, man. you can eat out. We always come the You're in a Santa Claus, yeah. <laughs> We're coming to sweet home for tonight. Oh, okay. Bye. <laughs> Alright, this is the girl that's been all over the world. <laughs> what's up? Hi. Is it Lena? Yeah, hello. Patrick. Hello. Nice to meet you. Tink. Hello, hello. Tink, tink, tink. Hello, hello. Hi. We hug, you know, because we are a big hiking family for tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta stay close, aren't you? Yeah. Oh my. Oh, what? Are you serious? Everyone in the line. It's just us. 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 I think it was one of the fanciest hot pots there because a lot of people were having palmian. So it was pretty a happy moment. We were like bonding together, chatting with each other. So now it's 7 p.m. <laughs> Anyways, it's pretty cold outside. <laughs> Tomorrow we're gonna wake up at 2.20. This is my first time going to sleep at 7 p.m. I plan to reach to the top as early as possible to so build, fly the drone. Stay there hopefully. longer, yeah. <laughs> Take more pictures. Good night, babies. <laughs> sleep well. Good night. Good night. Good morning. Oh my god. Alright, so we have ready to head out at 3 a.m. We're a little bit behind yeah, the schedule. <laughs> Lana just a little bit, a lot behind the schedule. Originally, we say, like, what, leaving at 2.30? So yeah, yeah. Right, like, no, come on, guys. <laughs> Patrick, what the heck? <laughs> That's so <shy. Yeah. laughs> high. No, because the backpack is so full. And it's like, <laughs> what kind of curtain is that? I don't know how to get out of here. I'm afraid it's going to be cold. I thought it was going to be cold and it's going to be cold. Oh. Oh. Guys, finally we reached Yishan. Hey, yeah, Yishan, Oh, come on, everyone is taking. Hey. Uh, <laughs> okay, now, almost can go home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. Just the middle is. 平缓的碎石路。没错。刚刚 Tank 跟我讲一个超没斗志的话，他刚刚说前面不是有木栈板吗？ Yeah. 那木栈板是一号吗？对，一号。然后总共有八十二个
八十二个。我刚刚经过了三号了，三号。Yeah， 我们刚刚三号了。好 ，excited， right？ excited， excited， right？ 加油！吼吼吼！哟哟哟 ，How you feeling now? I still feel like I'm at the police station. <laughs> Every time you point the camera at me, and we are almost at the lodge. Really? Yeah. How far are we to the lodge? I think four kilometers left. You okay? Just, just taking a little nap. <laughs> Justin, I, I think you might as well just sleep here. <laughs> Wow, it's super bright. Just now, like five minutes ago, we couldn't oh. even see what was behind us. Now we can see it. This is incredible. Can you imagine once we get on top, what kind of view we'll have there? I think I'll just cry. I can't wait to get on top already. <laughs> All I'm thinking about is like, I want to get on top right now and then like take a picture, go down, take a hot spring, and just yeah. like eat some nice food. <laughs> Look at Patrick. He especially prepared the jersey, the Taiwanese jersey. 我给你们看，你们应该很少人看过这个。不过这个是那个台湾足球队的衣服，所以我要在玉山山上穿这个，刚好应景。现在四足。跑到前面，从前面拍一分。呜呼呼 ！This is just like too beautiful. Look at those trees. Look at the path. Look at the rocks, the mountains, the clouds. Like everything just coming together. And the people. And the people. Wow, oh, you guys are making it look even more beautiful. <laughs> yeah, I was just looking there. It's like, mm, okay, beautiful. But looking there, it's like, oh my god. Like, my eyes like cannot see anything anymore because it's just the, too bright. Oh, you're too bright. Too much, right? Okay. Come on, we are almost at the lodge. So tired. Made it! Come on! Oh. Woo. Good job, good job, good job! Yeah, good job. Good day. Come on, yeah. come on! Yeah. So we're making palm in, like everyone's getting ready for the last ascent to the peak. And while we're eating the palm in, we saw some other hikers who finished reaching the top already. They're saying like, oh, today it's kind of like foggy. You can't see much up there. But I mean, the trail is clear. I mean, you can still go there, but it's just no sooner. So we're like, come on, we hike all the way to here just to reach the peak. Why not not to do it? Right at the time when we were about to leave, a miracle happened. The clouds just started to disappear. Yeah. I even saw a piece of the blue sky there, and we were like, "Oh my god, guys! Like we have to leave right away." All right, team, it's about time to hike to the peak. Finally. 哎，你们怎么没有人兴奋一下？要不要兴奋一下？好，再一次，再一次，再一次，重新的。Take two. Okay. Are you guys ready to hike to the peak? Yeah. 超假，超假。So we were walking up those past 300 meters. I was holding my GoPro. I was thinking to film everyone's faces once we reached the top. I, I remember I passed Fan. I think I passed Ooh. you. There were two guys in front. <laughs> and I was like, okay, okay I'm almost there. But I don't know why, but just out of nowhere, wow, the earth starts shaking crazily.
it's it's really hard to describe once you know you're really on the top of Taiwan and the top is shaking like crazy there's no place you can run there's no place you can find a safety and it's just you and that that mountain there 你眼前可以看到是瞬间大概有不知道是几百个还是几千个石头开始往你滚下来立即的反应就是用手去保护头一样说头不要被打到因为被打到应该会蛮严重的所以开始跑然后放在上面他刚好有被背包所以他用背部
how how's that how's the possible like wh how how did they know it was just us out there so it turns out the video fun was filming for the rescue team was already there in the news and it was there before we even let our families our relatives know about it we started to like dial the phone numbers telling our relative relatives we were okay because i can imagine if you see something like that in the news his parents could easily tell it was him different news they write different things some news saying like oh one person fractured the other person missing one news even used a picture i was laying on a chain circled me up and saying like i was in coma i was so worried that what if my relatives saw the news like how would it feel and i also worry like my grandma saw the news she, she might have a heart attack she was she lived by herself you know i worry so much about this and i still want to see them so i keep telling myself like hey doesn't matter what you fucking gotta walk seven hours just like walking and walking and walking so the whole time even though there are six people coming to help us but by the end of the day he he just walked by by himself we made it to the exit it was 7 pm and there was an ambulance waiting for us and i felt such a big relief finally he's going to the hospital but <laughs> yushan is not the place that is close to the city anyhow you still have a long way to go 那个最近是在南投的竹山秀主还需要两个小时的车程而且是救护车的速度 and we went to the emergency they started to do the x-ray 因为我那时候在救护车上面有吃了几口饭 so by the end of the day, he got the surgery only a day and a half after the injury. They were able to fix his bone. Now he can even move his fingers a little bit. <laughs> 呃, 我手术结束后了,大概第一天的时候吧 放在上面就说 Especially from those people that we never met personally, it's pretty touching that there is such a nice community out there willing to help people that don't even know. And huge thanks to everyone who helped us during our hike. It was really, really important for us to get some support at the moment. Because of this, we have to change our plans a little bit. Originally, we were thinking to go to the Philippines first film some videos there about diving, about beautiful islands that they have there but yesterday I had to cancel everything, the flight tickets, accommodation fortunately I managed to deal with my visa I was able to extend it a little bit so I can still stay in Taiwan for a little bit longer I guess we'll see you guys more in Taiwan for now <laughs> so yeah that's it for the story I wish you safe trips bye bye